the lecture i'm going to discuss about how to see active sql server connection so here we need to use uh, a simple query so writing use then after or uh, taking the master database let's uh, close then after use that go and uh, exe say execute command and there we need to use sp underscore who okay so this command we need to use so this is the uh, store procedure and with the help of this we can uh, see active sql server or inactive sql server okay then after let's use go one more time so this is the simple query to get the act SQL Server connection execute that then you can see this is uh, background uh, background it's not running and this is CMD now if I scroll down or uh, then you can see some are slipping 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 then uh, if I scroll down then you can get this place this is the runnable so SPID 53 is the runnable currently is working and this is the login name and the host name and this is master and the cmd type is now select okay so this is the way here we can find the active or inactive sql server connection so now you can see this is the slipping this is the running that means runnable man that means it's a active connection okay and here sums are background so if you find that to runnable that means this is the active connect connection currently is running so this is how we can get the active SQL Server connection. So I hope guys, this video is so helpful for you. So now this video is over. So thanks for watching. See you next to it. Thank you.